What can we get for Ricky today? Hi, could I get um, a plain toasted bagel with no cream cheese, just plain and toasted? Okay, anything else for you today? Um, yeah, could I also get a venti chai latte with coconut milk and a quad shot of espresso? Sure, is that hot or ice? Um, ice, sorry. Okay, anything else for you today? Um, no, thank you. Your total's gonna be 975 at the window. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hi guys, good morning. Um, so, Let's just let's just let's just go let's just go and spill the tea. Um, I literally got my period last night. Lit, great. I honestly TMI. Um, I was studying my really big midterm today for like ever since I got home yesterday from my day. I was like I studied until I went to bed, so like literally hours. Um, this guy, this guy in front of me is like like this. This kid is clearly like young and he like literally he's going on his phone and is like not moving up in the line and he cut like me off when we were getting into the drive through and honestly he's on, on my last nerve. Anyway, so I'll, clearly you can tell someone's PMSing. I'm a little irritable, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I was in excruciating pain last night. I was like bawling my eyes out. After I took painkiller, I took Midol. This morning I woke up at 7 a.m. like in such excruciating pain. I like did a heating pad, I laid down, I took another Midol. I'm just like, in, I was in a lot of pain. I'm now on three mile, which I know I shouldn't even take more than two, but I was literally in such excruciating pain. I have to go take this midterm, so. Yeah, I'm also getting a coffee, which I've heard is not the best for when you're on your, on your period, but I need the coffee or I literally will kill someone. So, yep. Um, I'm just wearing like this cute little sweater. I got, oh my God, I've ordered so much stuff for fall, like cute stuff for fall. Like I'm gonna do a fall beauty haul and then two separate fall clothing hauls. I don't care if people, people if you, I feel like most of you guys like the hauls and if you don't, just like don't watch them. Like I love hauls, okay? Um, also these sunglasses are from Ditto. Um, something exciting with them. But anyway, I mean, all my leggings were dirty this morning because I was clearly a flop last night. I didn't wash them. They're all like in my laundry hamper. And so actually I'm wearing, I'm just wearing like some Lululemon shorts, which is so weird because my thighs feel so thick. Cause like I just feel like, ugh, bloated and stuff. My stomach doesn't feel thin. Like normally I don't care. Like normally I wear like a lot of cropped, not like cropped stuff, but stuff that like can lift up. It's like low key crop. Not like crop tops that are like, yes, like titties. Like you cut off, but like, like tops that are like a length that if I move like my stomach shows, but I'm fine because I'm like, I work out, I have like, I like my stomach, like I have abs, like I'm fine, but I'm so bloated, so I look, look so freaking gross today. And so I'm wearing these like lemon shorts and then this like sweater, which I like the sweater, and then just some like Nikes. But I'm only, I'm only going to one class because the other two are canceled after that, after my class. So like, there's, and then there's like, I, I mean, honestly, like, I could stay and go to some other class, but I have so much to get done that I'm just not going to go to one of my classes, which I don't think is fucked up. Like, honestly, it's one, it's Friday, and I'm not just gonna wait around for two hours having cramps when I have so much to get done for tomorrow of that, like, I screening and, like, hair carpet and things like that, and I just have a lot going on in my life, so I'm not going to flop around for two hours, sit in traffic, and go to a class I hate anyway. Um, yeah, I'm aggressive today, aren't I? I'm a little feisty one. I'm usually not like this, it's just because, like, I don't know, just people People have been really irritating me the past few days. Like, I'm usually so peaceful and loving and calm, and I still am trying to be, but people have been really trying me the past few days. Just, like, bit business and work stuff. And I'm just kind of getting over it, so it's fine. I'm going to have an incredible day. I'll tell you what I'm going to do today. Um, oh, my gosh. This freak. I'm checking my email. Like, these people just piss me off. Okay, oh, I'm, I'm so excited for my bagel, guys. Honestly, my toasted bagel is about to revive me. Let's see this. Hello. Thank you. Thank you so much. batteries dying here. Also I'm not wearing big eyelashes. I'm just wearing makeup ever excessive lash because I just I don't have time for it today, clearly, as we can tell. I also need to put my Thank you so much. Have a good day. I got my is this toasted? Ah oh, yes it's fucking toasted. Thank 
gosh. But yeah, I'm not wearing mascara because, I mean, fake gosh, because I just, I'm not for it today. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to take my midterm. After that, I'm going to come home, make lunch for myself, probably vegetable fried rice because I'm fucking lazy today. But I'm not postmating. I will not do it today because last week I was a postmate whore and I can't do that this week. Um, and then I'm getting my nails done because I haven't gotten them refilled in eight weeks. They all like freaking broke off because it's been eight weeks. Like it's disgusting. And I'm just getting my toes done because I don't know if I told you both my toenails broke. So I'm going to ask to get fake ones put on. I'll bring you guys along today. My camera's dying right now, but I'll recharge it it's when I get home for my midterm. Whoa. Dude, this girl's texting and driving like swerving in my lane. Like honestly, fuck off. Um, but I turn, I'm going to turn right here. Yeah, I know. Yo, she's trying to cut me off too. Um, so I'm, that, that, that place takes like three hours to get my nails done, and now I'm getting toes probably like four. So, yeah, and then I'm getting a spray tan, and then I have to re edit part of a video, and then I have to clean up my apartment, take out like, all this recyclable shit. And then, and then also, I wanted to mention address this. A lot of you guys are like, asking about like my personal life and private life and I'm, I'm gonna keep like my relationships out of vlogs from now on and I don't know like I just the decision I made I just don't like it like my life is being judged on camera and like people don't people don't realize that they, all they see is like a little bit of the, that I show you that I have then edit then I decide to put up so you literally don't know my relationships at all like I'm sorry you don't like so I just I don't know that's why I don't show when I hang out with like you know what I mean? Like, I'm not going to show the, the, that, like, part. I show for my friendships. I'm not going to be showing, like, my relationships. That's why people are asking about, where's Shane? Where's this person? Blah, 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 blah. Like, I'm going to keep, especially, like, my, that type of relationships out of camera. So, I'm sorry. I'm just not going to be showing anymore. And, yeah, I, I haven't been. People are like, oh, my God, why don't you show? Like, we haven't seen this person. Blah, blah, blah. What's going on? And it's just, like, I'm, that's just, like, I learned my lesson. Showing a private life publicly. People will question you. People will make assumptions. You, you don't know. And, like, sorry, but, like, I love you guys, but you need to remember, like, and I'm sure a lot of you know that you only need to see what I decided to film on a certain day, and then I decided to edit, and then I decided to put up. So it's very, like, when people make such assumptions, it honestly pisses me off. So I'm just like, not, I'm just like, okay, that's it, I'm not showing anymore. So, the, oh my god, this motherfucking truck. Okay, get, get out of here. Bye, see ya, hasta la vista, hasta luego. But, um, so yeah, that's, so that's why if you don't see, that's why, like, on Friday nights, I don't really vlog if I'm like hanging out with someone like I don't know it's just like not I don't like this, this people interpreting like this isn't like a freaking not like an AP literature where we're trying to interpret something like this is my life and I'm done people try to make judgments I don't care if you make judgments about me but I hate people make judgments about relationships and what's going on in them and who's doing what and blah 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 that's just like uh, not something I'm down for so yeah I just wanted to say that I mean I love you guys to death but that's just like you know, not gonna be a thing anymore, but it's totally fine. It's low-key. I haven't been showing you for the past, like, month, and no one's really cared. I feel like people are like, oh, where is this person? But, like, they're mm -hmm. fine. Oh, my God. Oh, this bagel, though. Mm. Okay, I will talk to you guys after my midterm. Hope it goes well. I just hate also people stare at you and, like, you're at the stoplight. Like, can I help you? Oh, my God. This freaking truck is, like, literally harassing me. I'm over it. I'm so sorry. Obviously, PMS is getting the best of me today. I'm gonna be fine. It's gonna be a good day. Don't you worry. I can't wait. Also, I'm gonna get long nails today. I'm doing like short rounded, but today I'm gonna be doing like long coffin again because I miss that vibe. I don't know what color, but I always do something crazy with my nails, so I'm gonna tell her to just like go for it, you know? I might do like PBA, like the three letters, like on, the, I don't know. That would've been cute if they were short. It's not gonna look cute if they're long, actually. Because for my astrology, my astrology launches, I've been doing so many calls with you guys, and so many, a ton of you have ordered the most intense birth chart. So I'm working on all that stuff, and you will get it within the two weeks, I promise, of course. Which is so exciting. And if you haven't yet checked out that and you're interested, I'll leave a link down below. It's been really great. I was talking to you guys, it's so amazing. I'm so sorry that I'm sassy today. It's honestly because, like, I'm just like really like my stomach really hurts and then like obviously i'm a little bit moody and then, like people have been annoying me you know i'm gonna shut up i love you guys so much and i'll talk to you guys soon i'm back from my midterm it went so well i mean I, it wasn't like oh yeah so well but it was like pretty like it was really pretty good i know that makes no sense but like 
I knew more than I thought and it was like really good. So I'm back home. I right now just have fed Coco. I want to show you some of Coco's accessories I've gotten lately. I know it's really random, but if you're a cat owner, kitten owner, child owner, maybe you'll appreciate. So basically, hi. so she has these really cute bowls. I think I've showed them to you before. I don't know if you can see it's like a little cat. And this is her dry food, which is she eats, if you're wondering, the organics kitten grain free. We, we all know she's a bougie woman, okay? So she obviously eats the best food. So it's honestly because it's, I'm, I don't know, like I, I just, the, her, her veteran, my veteran, her veterinarian, why can't I talk today? Recommended it. It's like organic. It's, you don't want your kids to be eating grains. It's really bad for them. And I get it at Whole Foods and a bag lasts me like three months because she eats so little because she's so, she's only right now five months old. And then she eats wet food and she eats this wellness turkey and salmon and then she also eats a different one which i think is chicken um and it's also grain free you can do a lot of research on grains it's so bad for them if you have it to so make sure if you have a cat or kitten i would be making sure and then i got her this little rubber mat from amazon it was like 10 dollars because her food was spilling like this Just, i don't know i'm not gonna put that back on it but um so it's kind of like gross like it was falling all over the floor and then like if the floor is dirty i don't want her to eat that so she has this like nice little white rubber mat that if while she eats like food and stuff falls out of her mouth it's fine and then i just like clean off the mat every day and she eats like i feed her in portions breakfast lunch and dinner this wellness food and lately i got her hold on sorry just some tarot cards um i got her this you someone recommended one of you guys commented like hey you should get her um a cover for the food which is so nice of you guys like yours I, I was I, I needed to because I was like I don't know what I was thinking I like didn't have one so now like it keeps our food fresh and like this one I can link I'll link both these Amazon items if you have a cat or dog or you want this it, it has like three sizes in it so like you can put it it'll it'll close if it's small it'll close if it's big but these are really big so also yeah that's how I was doing like a tarot reading um, but yeah so that's, I've been like using this and then Today, I ordered this like the day it came out, <clears throat> the Lorac Mega Pro. I have never had one of the palettes, but I, I saw a pick of the Mega Pro 3, and I'm not kidding, guys. I've never, I've been like really careful with buying makeup, but like I'll, I'll rebuy stuff. Also, I'm using this Lancome foundation, and I hate it. I hate it so much. Um, I need to like order two day shipping the kit back to my Kat Von D one because I honestly hate this one. <laughs> it's like, it's just like, it does not last on me. I have oily skin. I put it on and it's already coming off and it's like settling into my skin making my pores huge and my face look disgusting. You can't tell on camera as much, but it's really bad and I don't recommend it. Um, but anyway, I only buy palettes if I like am in love with it. Like I saw the Modern Renaissance was so hyped, but none of those colors would have worked for me. I'm so cool toned. Like my hair is like ashy. My eyes are blue. Like on me, warm colors aren't the best unless they're like purpley and like more cool toned. I saw the Lauric Mega Pro 3 and I was like, this is mine. So I ordered it and it just came and I thought I'd show it to you if you're curious it looks like this it's really thin I love the white and the rose gold <laughs> literally I like came I parked my car and then like I went to the my mail and got it immediately but like holy shit can we I'm just gonna show you guys all the colors the first row honestly turns me on like the these the, they're so creamy I swatched them I don't know if you can tell like look how buttery look at those shades honestly fuck me up there's so many pretty like ones for fall like ew, look at my nails ah okay before i'm gonna go get my nails in right now so look at how ratchet before all right okay and now like look at this rose quartz and there's a red which is crazy but such pretty colors like holy crap so buttery like oh i love like all these like i love like all these types of colors like these the, these right there oh my gosh even coco's obsessed i also like i don't know where i'm gonna swatch this i'm just gonna like burn them up burn them out rub them out <laughs> I'm like really weird. I'm like all over the place today, but look how beautiful. So yeah, okay, I don't want her to lick them. She will. She she will lick them. It's weird. So yeah, that's the, this is this palette. I'm gonna put it away because she might bite the ends of it. Right now I'm gonna go call my Uber and head to my nail appointment. Dude, I fucking hate this foundation. I'm gonna show it to you guys so you don't buy it because it's so bad. Like I really just want you not to do it. It's this, and it was like fifty something dollars. It's the Lancome. Tunt Idol Ultra Cushion Oil Free Long Wear. Long wear my ass. I don't know what long wear is, but if long wear is 40 minutes, then okay. I'm not going to put it on 40 minutes later. Like, I literally looked in the mirror when I was at, in the bathroom uh, on campus, and literally it was like coming off so greasy. And I used a primer, and it was just like, it's coming off. It settles into your lines. It looks gross. It literally looks like you were in the hot sun for eight hours, your makeup sliding off. So I don't know what the fuck this is. Like, so gross. 
Oh, I'm so sorry that I'm like aggressive, but I just like really like when products are so like bad, it was just I don't I don't know, maybe it works for someone, but not for me. Anyway, I'm drinking some tea so I can calm down. Um it's caffeine free, don't worry. And I'm going to go to the nails and I'm want to get coffin nails like baby pink and my toes done. So I'll obviously bring y'all along, y'all. <coughs> and so I got back from my nails and airbrush tan and look at this. She freaking slayed them. They're like um, she did she, the girl who does my nails. She builds the tip herself. So these aren't like fake like it's not like she it's not like she takes like that glue people, people take that nail glue and they put like a gel Builder powder on top and then do like a gel polish the place I go to just Japanese gel So she literally like creates this tip herself like literally Takes like the gel and like makes the fake nail herself with Japanese gel. It's so she's so talented and so cool um I'll, I'll put a place down below I go to if you're curious. I, I'm not getting sponsored to say this. I pay everything. You don't even get a discount or anything. I'm just telling you guys if you're curious. And then she uses this thing called fairy dust. So she takes like this this um, like rubber wand and presses in this like really iridescent powder. So it gives it this like gold reflect. You wouldn't even know. But like if you look closely, there's like really small shimmers. You see that? You see, you see how it reflects gold right there? That's because the fairy dust. It's like so, the powder is so thin that when you press it into the nail, it just looks like that. See, it looks like a sheen. It doesn't look like there's like chunky glitter, but it's just so small. And then I got my toes fixed. I'm not going to show you my toes because it's really gross, but like, also my skin's like breaking out because I'm on my period. But both my toes broke off. It was an ordeal. And they, she, she, she like, like made fake ones on my nails for me, another girl. And like now they look like normal. You'd never even know. They look like perfect, square, beautiful toenails, but under they're like broken. But you never know. So. That's the stuff. I just got an airbrush tan. I'm like not wearing a bra under this. Free the nip, but I'm already getting it. It like starts developing instantly, but then like gets dark over time. And yeah, I'm about to just chill out. I'm going to like fix my face, do a mask. Oh, but I'm finally got my hair done, got my nails done, got my hair brush, and I'm feeling so much better. I still need to get my hair like colored one more like one more time because like um I want to go a little bit like lighter. I wonder what's gonna what I'm gonna do this Friday. I think is bring down more brown so i want to i want to bring down brown until like to like here like all brown and then lighten the rest but I've, i just got the extensions retape basically hair is really can like a lot like you know if you don't know about extensions and stuff like that it's like really hard to explain like because i want to get my hair color but i just got these retapes so i'd have to wait like two two months until i have to get these taken out to be able to color my real like hair so you could try to color the hair that's not in the extensions but that's only like half like when you have tape-ins and then you're blonde and then you want balayage like it's so hard to like coordinate like Getting your tapins retaped with color and all that stuff. It's like a whole different life. But yeah. Oh my gosh, look. Hi. Hi. Hi, ma'am. Do you like the Lorac Mega Pro? Oh yeah. She knows when she's on camera. She literally acts. She performs. Oh my gosh. Anyone, also, if anyone ever comes over, she acts so cute with them. It's so sweet. You just know. You know when you're on camera, huh? Oh yeah. Now you're purring, children, you're a good little girl. Yeah.